Here at State Tech, we teach the five basic processes of welding. Gas metal arc, gas tungsten arc, shielded metal arc, flux core arc welding, and oxy-fuel. We teach according to AWS standards, American Welding Society standards, because they are accepted worldwide. Again, we are trying to get students prepared for the workforce by being a supervisor of forming material. We want them to be technically knowledgeable of what they're getting into. Hands-on is so important because again, if I tell you, you might learn. If I show you, you might learn. But if you put your hands on it and burn yourself, you're gonna learn, it's hot. Here at State Tech, we have state-of-the-art welding facility. We have brand new Lincoln welders. We have a plasma table. We have a robotic welder to make our students well-rounded. I chose this program because basically we get this brand new facility to use and really everything we're going to experience in the real world gets thrown at us and really just every process we get to do and experience here. Welding is a very high demand uh, job right now and there's endless opportunities all over the United States and even all over the world for welding jobs and having State Tech on my resume is an added bonus. Our instructors really take good care of making sure that we learn everything that we need to know so that when we go out there and get a job, there's nothing they'll be able to throw at us that we haven't already seen before. Uh, we're nonstop. We have about 10 certifications a semester we have to get done. So it's fast paced learning what you're doing and getting it all done. Uh, I've never been a bookwork kind of guy. I've always been out in the shop, wanting to work with my hands. That's what I do best. I love the new shop and all the great equipment we have in it. Uh, every welder has, I think, 500 plus processes on it. So when you get in your booth, you can do everything you need to do and get everything done within one area. I have already heard from a couple of our employers on our advisory committee that whenever a state tech student comes in, they don't even give them a welding test. They just put them straight to work because they know how to do it. That's what we pride ourselves on, again, getting them up to industry standards. Again, we want them to be totally prepared so they can't throw nothing new at them. 